Hi everybody, it is the 2nd of November, um, Wednesday. Uh, wanted to remind everybody that it looks like today is going to be the clubhouse. I'm going to be logging in with Aaron at 11 o'clock this morning because he is in India. And we're going to set this whole thing up from India, so he'll be sending out a notice, but we're still back at 3 o'clock. I'm just going to log in, get it all set up, and then ignore it for a few hours. Um, so, uh, so Clubhouse today, um, we had a real fun uh, screening of the documentary film last night for a, uh, a, a, a group of people that have like a like a film society. It wasn't a, uh, it wasn't a festival or anything like that. There was no, um, voting or anything like that. It's this group that's together that has been together for a very long time and they just, uh, screen movies and, uh, you know, and Russ and I and Denny, uh, went and did the Q and A afterwards. And, uh, it was down near San Diego and, uh, the crowd loved it. Got a standing ovation at the end. And, um, some really good questions in the Q&A and a little bit of a hang afterwards. So it was it was great. And then Denny is off today uh, to Phoenix, to the Phoenix Film Festival. So there's a whole bunch. There's the um, Minneapolis Film Festival, St. Louis Film Festival. We're all going to be back with the band at New York for the New York Documentary Film Festival. So things are moving along. Um, I can't, you know, the uh, new video is is about ready to be launched for the uh, media families. Um, Toughest girl in town single. Um, so lots of stuff going on. It's really really exciting. And it got up today and it's wet outside. Like it it's rained a bit and hopefully there's more rain coming through because uh, we so desperately need rain here. With this this drought situation um, in California or in the West is <clears throat> really horrible. And uh, so we are in dire need of moisture. And so it's nice to see anything we can get our, you know, our hands on at this point. It's really good. Um, I'm going to go back today and, and visit. I've done one little uh, uh, video with this artist uh, a while back when her album first came out. And I really like it. I've listened to it a lot. <clears throat> and she's amazingly talented uh, musician, so I thought I would visit a few more tracks from this. Uh, her name is Lari Basilio, and um, she's from Sao Paulo, Brazil, and uh, a really gifted guitarist. She started playing, um, or she got turned on to organ uh, when she was four years old, and then when she was eight, her father um, showed her um, guitar, and that was she was off and running at that point. And uh, she's had a really successful uh, career at this point um, as, a, as a musician and, uh, and building her, uh, her inventory, let's say. She reminds me a, a lot, her playing reminds me a lot of Daryl Sturmer uh, from Phil Collins and Genesis Band. Um, she's very articulate, very creative in her, in her writing. Um, but just her, her facility on the instrument is really quite something. And uh, I really, uh, we had so much fun making this record. I'm gonna, we had, um, I'm gonna get in here. We recorded this um, at United Studios, and United Recording Studios. And, uh, and once again, it was one of those things. I walked into that studio and that was the studio we recorded in uh, 1967 when I was in the band group Therapy. And uh, the Wrecking Crew played on our record. That was the first time I'd ever really been in a real studio. And, I, and uh, looking through the window at uh, Hal Blaine and Carol Kay and Mike Melvoin and uh, Al Casey, all these people, never dreaming I would ever be able to do this you know, after watching them. And, uh, and then a couple of years later, I was working with them every day. It's been an amazing journey. So every time I walk into United A, I kind of just get this really wave of nostalgia rolls over me. But um, so we did this. We recorded it at, at United Recorders. It was um, mixed at Cube Recording Studios, and it was mastered at Star Delta Audio Mastering. Um, it's uh, myself, Vinnie Caliuta, <laughs> the great Vinnie on drums, um, 
Esther Na on keyboards. It was engineered by Scott Moore and, and um, mastered by Andy Miles, mixed by Ross Rothero Borge. Um, uh, and, and I mean, uh, oh, well, actually, the recording engineer for basic tracks and everything was Don Murray, who had done like, really, this is where the coincidences come. I hadn't even re realized it where. Um, it was recorded by Don Murray, and Don Murray did Daryl Sturmer's records um, that I worked on. So it's actually, we went a full circle there. And, um, and this is great. I mean, uh, Laurie produced it, uh, played electric and acoustic guitars, some keyboards, uh, did all the arranging. I mean, she's really, really talented um, artist. And um, I'm going to go ahead and play a few of these tracks from this just to let you hear what, what this artist has to say musically. Um, so here we go. This one is called All To You. Let me see if there's any additional info on this one that I might see here. Um, nope. Nope. So let's just listen. Uh, All To You, Larry Basilio.
He's really a fine, fine musician. Here's one called It's Been a While. cut that track and uh, I was sitting in the room and there was an ISO booth just to my left when we were cutting the electric stuff Laurie was sitting right across from me but there was this ISO booth where she was doing the acoustic guitar in there and uh, so I could watch her play and as soon as that song started I, Vinny was to my right we both looked at each other and went wow wow I mean she's just got beautiful beautiful technique and she's really fun to watch when she plays. I mean, it's like she's living every note. It's uh, it's really a joy to be in the same room working with her. Um, here's one called Novo. Let's get the downbeat, come on.
all these tracks are, I cut this album with my Dingwall. It seemed like the perfect instrument for her music. Get a lot of real low-end support on that. Um, here's one last tune. This is called Running to the Other Side. And then I'm going to run to the other side. <laughs> facility I mean she's beautiful compositional skills but just her facility and fluidity in her playing is really something so that's Laurie Basilio from Sao Paulo Brazil um, so clubhouse today I will see all of you who are uh, can make it and uh, it's always fun I really look forward to it see what kind of direction we end up traveling in 
every time. So um, take good care. All my best wishes. I'll be back uh, tomorrow. We've got uh, some uh, Zooms to do in the morning. Denny and I are doing one about the movie, so I'm looking forward to that. It's, it's just so much fun being involved in something that's so different than anything I've ever done. Um, it's, uh, and I'm just really appreciative of the effort that's been put into this project by the, by Denny and the, and the production team and everybody who is involved in this. It's really amazing. I can't wait till you're all able to see it. So uh, I'm going to get running and I'm going to wish everybody a great day. I'm hoping for more rain and uh, I'm going to go feed the puppies now and uh, get on with my day. So take good care and I'll see you tomorrow or this afternoon. Bye-bye.